and would overcome the fiercest of adversaries. He was somewhat blind to a certain degree. He did not see a person's age, their social status, their educational level, or any other characteristic. To Jim, everyone was equal. He was an excellent executive, but also a man of the people. And as you saw in some of the video, and some that you will see in a minute, he would jump in and do whatever needed to be done to get the job done. Before I conclude, I'd like to share an interaction that occurred during Jim's treatment. We were at the cancer center when his blood work revealed a major concern for his oncologist. So much so that he wanted him to go to the emergency room. The ER was just two blocks away from the cancer center on the campus, where Shan's UF. And nonetheless, the doctor wanted an ambulance to take him there. When the ENT group got to Jim, one man kept looking at him and saying, I know you. I know you from somewhere. And Jim's reply was, probably. <laughs> I was the mayor here. Mr. Mayor, he says, that's it. It's so good to see you again. Certainly not under these circumstances, but it's so good to see you. However, he wanted to assure myself and Jim that he would really take good care of him. Then he turned to his fellow workers and said, you see, this man, Jim Painter, has done so much for Gainesville. He was so supportive to all the employees. He is most definitely precious cargo. In conclusion, I again thank the association for this tremendous honor. Had he been here tonight, Jim would have cherished this award and, giving, and given you all, or y'all, a glimpse of that killer smile. Thank you so much.